the remarkable retro co cosmetic manufacturing technology was developed. This technology is 1,000 times as effective as the previous cosmetic. This technology extracts the materials with excellent beauty effect from green tea and the persimmon leaf. With this technology, immediately we can acquire the import and substitute effect of $100 million. Although the natural plant resources, including green tea, and persimmon leaves, and liquid roots, and mulberry leaves, prevented uh, aging and has their excellent uh, with, uh, whitening effect, it is impossible to refine the cosmetic component. Korea Atomic Energy Research Institute and a venture company solved jointly this problem with radiation. That is, by shooting radiation to the chemical compound extracted from natural resources and so transforming the structure of the chemical compound, they succeeded in eliminating the largest obstacles, including the unnecessary colors, impure materials, and odors. This technology can not only increase such effect, but also refine the cosmetic components by the high purity degree of 100%. The another core of this technology was to reduce the natural chemical compound to the average size of 33 nanometer, and less than 1 per 3 of the skin cell uh, interval by nanotechnology, and so uh, united the natural chemical compound to permeate the skin, and then uh, prolong the duration of makeup by 100 times. The rate of previous natural chemical compound is 500 times as high as that of previous natural cosmetics, so that we can use their excellent functions easily. Through deep new technology development, our country can occupy our advantageous position in the natural chemical compound market of several thousand billion won every year. The scale of natural chemical compound used for cosmetics is $10 billion every year. If we enter the full-scale production next year, we expect not only the import substitute effect of $10 million per year, but also the enormous export effect. Until now, some products have been uh, advertised as the pure vegetable cosmetics, but strictly speaking, only a part of vegetable raw material were added to those products. Then, um, through the technology which Korea Atomic Energy Research Institute developed for the first time in the world, we can add the uh, extract from natural material including green tea or persimmon leaves to cosmetics in large quantity. Although in the common plant of our neighborhood, including green tea and persimmon leaves, uh, includes the roots and the mulberry leaves, there were whitening and moisturizing effects. Their utilization was limited due to their colors and odors. This is the common kind of persimmon leaf. If this leaf is dipped in alcohol, it becomes a black liquid like this. The core of this technology is to make this liquid transparent. Radiation Food Biotechnology Research Team, Korea Atomic Energy Research Institute, shot the gamma ray emitted by cobalt-60 to this liquid and so succeeded in eliminating the unnecessary components, including colors, odors, and residual agricultural chemicals without changing raw materials. This technology is to refine the impure materials extracted from various natural plants by transforming their chemical structure. According to this technology, this institute developed the mock-up with uh, Korea Korma Company uh, Limited, the cosmetic expert manufacturing firm. Korea Korma applied the technology of multi-encapsulating this natural chemical compound to the size of um, from 5 to um, 30 nanometer and so enhanced the effect of sociological activation and absorption. According to the clinical experiment result in a dermatology hospital during several months, no side effect occurred. The previous vegetable cosmetics could not increase the vegetables in diluted solution by more than 
enjoyed that to 1%, whereas the development of this technology can increase the vegetable in dilutive solution by more than enjoyed that 5% with the increasing effect of 100 times. If this technology is commercialized, it will have the import substitute effect of 130 billion won per year and the considerable export and competitiveness in the world market scale of 1,300 billion won. The new natural, natural-friendly cosmetic materials using radiation were developed by the domestic research team for the first time in the world. This is the new natural cosmetic materials which were developed by the Dr. Byung Byung Woo's team of Korea Atomic Energy Research Institute. By using radiation, we can maintain various effective components of natural plant, including green tea and persimmon leaves, but eliminating colors so that we can utilize the raw materials of cosmetics, food, and medicines. So, in the past, various vegetable resources had the excellent and sociological function, including the effect of preventing practice and aging, they are difficult to utilize as cosmetics owing to their colors and their side effects. This technology is to refine materials with a high purity degree by using radiation, and so ultra-minimize, uh, that is, nanomize the refined materials, and then multi-encapsulate the mm, nanomized materials. This technology was developed for the first time in the world. This technology is to maintain the physiological activation of natural chemical compound and refine the natural chemical compound with the condition of no color, no taste, and no other and without changing the product feature and solve completely the side effect of artificial chemical compound. If the gamma ray are shot to the green tea extract, which are refined like this, the extract can be used easily. If the natural chemical compound with a high purity degree of 99.9% uh, .9 is transformed into the uh, three-staged multi-capture, the cosmetic can uh, permeate the skin easily so that the physiological uh, functions of natural chemical compound can be prolonged in a long time. Especially, the refinement technology of high purity degree can increase the addition rate of natural cosmetics from the uh, previous 0.01% to 0.5% so that it can increase the effect of functional cosmetics by more than 100 times. The world natural chemical compound market is about $10 billion. As this technology is commercialized as cosmetic, it is expected to have the export effect of more than $100 billion per year and the spillover effect on the overall industry inclu including the new material development. Although there are many cosmetics and food with natural component owing to the technological limit, a little effect occurs. Then, recently, the technology, which can increase the natural component content by 500 times, was developed by the domestic research team. Recently, in the cosmetic market, the functional products for the wrinkle improvement and whitening effect are popular. Though mostly the natural vegetable components are contained, owing to the technological factor, only the minimum is contained, and so its effect is tiny. However, the new technology, which overcame this obstacle, was developed by a company and a research institute jointly. The core of the new technology was to use radiation refinement technology and so maintain the natural component, but then eliminate colors, smells, and taste. Because the refinement technology does not exist, mostly we import it from Japan and USA. However, whether this developed technology will be exported to Japan and USA. Also, by using the nanotechnology, this technology covered the multiple captures to protect the natural components. According to the explanation of the research team, if this refinement technology and the ultra-fine particle technology are used, the absorption rate of natural component can increase by 500 times. Now the product market using the natural component is $10 billion per year all over the world and is 100 billion ones in our country. According to Karma Korea, 
This is a fitted in joint development. If this technology is commercialized, it will have the import and export substitute effect of 100 billion ones. These research teams plan to enlarge their research for not only cosmetics but also foods and medicine. The new natural and nature-friendly cosmetic materials using radiation were developed by the domestic research team for the first time in the world and uh, attracting our interest. Especially, this technology is the new technology which combines radiation, nanotechnology, and biotechnology. It will exert the large influence on the world cosmetic market of more than $10 billion per year. Today, the on-the-spot Focus will uh, examine the new technology with Dr. Pyeong Myung Woo of Korea Atomic Energy Research Institute, which developed the new natural cosmetic technology. How are you, doctor? How are you? First, the new technology developed this time is the technology of natural cosmetic materials. Please explain this technology easily. The previous chemical compound for cosmetics and food have used their artificial chemical compound. Whereas, owing to uh, health disorders or side effects, this technology uh, reflects the trend to return to natural chemical compound uh, internationally. So, this time we developed a technology which extracted the new natural materials of high purity degree from our domestic plant resources with uh, excellent uh, sociological effect and then used the new materials for cosmetics, food, and medicine. Is it the natural part? Yes, it is. You explained that uh, these natural materials could be utilized freely for cosmetics. Did the clinical experimental result of their mock-cut produce? Yes, they did. The previous product uh, to which various natural materials were added in our country were insufficient in the purity degree, and that is the refinement technology and then the technology to preserve, activate, and maintain the refined technology were insufficient. So the previous technology could not add the natural materials sufficiently, whereas this technology can increase the addition of the natural materials by more than um, from five to six times. So. The result of clinical experiment in the domestic and dermatology hospitals are very excellent. Especially now because the clinical experiment is uh, executing in preparation uh, for exporting to France and USA, the result will be better. In the process of developing these materials, you use the radiation. Radiation can be dangerous. Will such part be tested? Yes. The test on safety was completed. Generally, radiation is dangerous to general people. However, we think that we we'll live with radiation together. Because the radiation which we use this time is identical with the ultraviolet rays emitted by sunlight and the microwave and electromagnetic wave emitted by microwave range in home. It is safe. In particular, more than 50% uh, of previous cosmetic products are uh, sanitized by radiation. Ah, they are. This new technology development uh, seems to exert a large influence on the world cosmetic market. How much will the economy effect be? Now, we import the new natural materials of 130 billion won per year from foreign countries. Thus, except the import substitute effect of 130 billion won, it will have the export effect of from two to three times as high as the import substitute effect. Especially now, we can dominate internationally the technology to refine the new materials from the natural materials and maintain the refined effect in a long time. If this is developed, it is most important to commercialize this technology. Which plan do you have about it? The cost of commercialization decreased by more than about 1 per 500 in comparison with the previous method of refining the natural materials. Next, because we hold our investigating facilities, the commercialization will be soon in early next year. Next, the American major cosmetic firms, including Coty and Estrogen, 
will visit Earth on September 17 this year. If they visit Earth in relation to technology, the commercialization will be accomplished soon from next year. I hope that this new technology with its logic economic effect can achieve the good result. Thank you for coming um, directly today. Up to now, we identified the new natural cosmetic materials, which was developed by our country for the first time in the world with Dr. Byung Myung-woo of Korea Atomic Energy Research Institute.